expansion commands were a huge part of King Hearts 2's gameplay. They were such a huge part, in fact, that they had their own boost ability. Does that make any sense? Probably not. Anyway, reaction commands were present in many bosses, and we are first introduced to them in the prologue while fighting the Twilight Door. And from this fight alone, you could tell that the reaction commands were going to be a big deal. And a big deal they certainly were. They were literal lifesavers alongside abilities like Second Chance and Once More. Bonus points for them for making you feel like an absolute fucking ninja with all these crazy moves going on. I mean, we're literally slicing skyscrapers here for God's sake. Look at this shit. The best two examples of them being lifesavers though are the Zaldan fight in Beast Castle and the Hydra fight in Olympus Coliseum. And one more fight I forgot to mention, and I remember that just now, is the fight against Cyax. You literally can't do shit without reaction commands in this fight. I would also like to point out a certain instance where they are pretty much broken. And that is in the Xemnas vs Sora 1v1 fight, where if you press triangle at the right time, you can bring Mr. Zebra Man over here to literally 1 HP. Also, in the final fight against Xemnas, you have to spam X and triangle while Xemnas is putting on his little light show. Only this is the kind of light show where if you stop spamming like a moron, you're dead. Now that you have an idea of probably the most controversial aspect of Kingdom Hearts 2's gameplay, it's time to talk about Kingdom Hearts 4. Back in April of last year, when we got the Kingdom Hearts 4 trailer, there were rumors and speculations going around about reaction commands making a possible comeback. However, as of, the as of the time of this recording in August of 2023, nothing has been confirmed officially by Square. But should they even return? Well, my answer would be yes. And before you absolutely obliterate me in the comments harder than Sora obliterates Ansem Riku, let me explain myself real quick. I am absolutely aware that there are people who don't like how much of an effect the reaction commands had in Cage 2. And I can agree that they can be borderline broken at times. That does not mean they are utterly and completely OP as a concept. As much as we like to joke about Kingdom Hearts being a button masher, you won't win a fight by just spamming triangle in Kingdom Hearts 2. Therefore, I believe that they should return in a similar fashion to how they were in Kingdom Hearts 2. However, maybe they should be a little bit more balanced this time around, and if that goes well, I really don't see why having them in bosses, in a few bosses at least, would be a problem. So yeah, if reaction commands were to make a return, I would certainly be excited rather than disappointed as long as they're not broken. And that should conclude this little discussion video. As always, leave your opinions in the comments, and thank you so much for watching, until the next video or stream, bye bye!